Hi, thank you for visiting Chicago Cars Direct. This is a 2012 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Sahara four-wheel drive. Uh, it is bright white over a bright white top and saddle leather interior. It's my favorite color combination they've ever done. I just do want to walk around the vehicle with you so you can see every angle and every panel. Uh, we do these videos for our clients who uh, might not be right down the street from us so you can get an idea of what the vehicle looks like um, from every angle. So I'm just going to go to the passenger side here and um, kneel down and zoom in so you can see everything. But it's a, it's a gorgeous Jeep. It's absolutely no paint work actually. We took a um, professional paint meter and measured every uh, panel. Uh, every panel is uncompromised. There's uh, it's all factory paint. There's no uh, previous accidents or issues or anything like that. Just looks phenomenal. Zoom into the back here so you can see everything. Oh, it looks so nice. You can see the tow package there. And go to the passenger side. I don't know if you can see this, but see the uh, running boards on the side. Those look great. Those are white. Painted to match. They really make the vehicle look terrific. And on the Sahara, of course, the uh, fenders, uh, the flared fenders, those are painted body color as well from the factory. So this is definitely a Hummer uh, vibe to it with all the uh, paint to match colors. It, it really has got a Hummer look to it. Especially, see that? It's painted white here on the rear bumper, side steps, the flares. Uh, it looks like a Hummer H2 or an H1. But luckily it's not because I like these better than the H, the Hummers, sorry. I know that's sacrilege to some people but especially with this new 3.6 liter engine it's much much better than a Hummer. But I'm biased because I've owned Jeeps. I'll just show you all the hood. It, it just, the paint looks great. If I can see any imperfections I will uh, definitely point them out. Um, but I'm having trouble finding anything. Um, it really just looks great. I'm sure there's some paint or rock chips somewhere but again I'm having trouble finding them. Is that one right there? No I think that's dirt. Oh yeah that's just dirt. <laughs> it came right off. Alright I'll try to find something though. Because I'm sure no car is perfect. That's the Jeep front end. It looks so nice. Everything works the way it should. You see that painted body color here too on the front bumper? Looks great. And we're going to open up the engine for you so you can see what it looks like. As I was saying earlier, um, Thank you sir. Uh, best part about the Jeep is this new engine. It's a 3.6 liter Pentastar um, six cylinder engine. Um, it's 285 horsepower and 260 pounds foot of torque. It is miles and miles ahead of uh, where the Jeeps used to be in terms of their engine. Um, it's made it to a five speed automatic now so not only did horsepower go up about 80 horsepower but the gas mileage went up quite a bit. It's a lot more efficient, a lot smoother, a lot torqueier. And I just want to show you the whole engine bay. Everything is exactly where it should be. Again, no evidence of any accidents or previous issues. It looks just so nice. Even though they covered the engine up with this, this cover here, this Jeep cover, everyone's going towards that, but looks a lot cleaner in the engine bay at least.
Okay, let's show you the, the rear of the vehicle. Looks like somebody put nitrogen in their tires. <laughs> it's usually a good sign. Uh, it, it is very, very clean back here. Uh, there's no smoke smells or odors or pet smells. There's no um, discoloration on the carpeting. There's no rips or tears or, or stains. Uh, everything is exactly the way it should be. That's my other favorite thing is the saddle leather interior is absolutely beautiful. Especially with the white. And there's some black accents too, which is a really good contrast. That's the premium sound system. That's the Infinity premium sound system. That is, uh, that is standard on the um, Sahara. That's one of the extra features. And we're going to turn on the engine so you can hear it. And I do want to zoom in on the leather back here. And we're going to open the windows because it's a, it can get a little dark in a Jeep because there's no sunroof. Or... But you can take the top off. I'm sure you know this already. If you're looking at this video, you probably already know this about Jeeps. But they are the most fun. There's just something about them. If you've never had a Jeep, you won't understand. If you've had one, you'll understand. There's just a sense of freedom, and um, it's they're so great to drive. I unfortunately had to get rid of mine because I have a baby on the way, but um, when they graduate college, I'm getting another one. I'll be 90, but that's fine. Anyway, sorry, I'm rambling. Here's the driver's seat. Um, so you can take a look at all the leather. Oh, it looks great. I love the leather. It's so nice. We put this plastic down on the floor just so um, it protects it, but the, the carpeting looks terrific on the floor. I know that's dark. I'm going to show you the passenger seat. And I love how the Jeep um, is in, embossed into the seat too. It's just a nice little touch. So this has the power door locks, which was something I was never used to on my Jeep. I never had power door locks or windows or mirrors or anything. Mine was, <laughs> and I had the upgraded model, but I had none of that. I love this little detail here too. Jeep since 1941. That's so cool. He really upgraded the interior. The navigation system is actually very easy to use. Very intuitive. It has a Sirius satellite radio. It's based off a hard disk drive. So you can actually throw music onto it using a USB. So if you have some music or a book on um, CD or audiobook that you just listen to a lot, you can put it onto the um, the hard disk drive and I think it's about a 40 gig hard drive on this system. Um, it has Uconnect to the Bluetooth. Those are your power windows which is pretty cool on a Jeep. <laughs> Here's your uh, automatic climate control again on a Jeep really? It's, it's like a Lexus. <laughs> it's a lot it's a lot of stuff on it. There's a lot of luxury features that I'm not used to. It's got power power um, mirrors, which is which is really cool, and they're heated. There's so many times where I had to open my window manually because I, I didn't have power, and I had to wipe off the mirrors um, with my gloves because they would freeze over because they weren't power. And these are heated seats, stability control, hill descent control. So cool. Your five speed automatic transmission. Which again is so smooth. Uh, it's just night and day from the older transmission. It used to be a four speed automatic. Now it's a five speed automatic mated to, you know, the Pentastar V8, the V6, V8, V6. I wish. Um, <laughs> they should put an SRT8 engine in here. 6.1 liter, 420 horsepower. That's on my Christmas wish list. Vehicle has 33,833 miles on it, but I probably am going to be driving it over the weekend, so there's going to be a few more than that.
I'll be gentle, but I do want to drive this. Look how nice they they, they re redid the uh, dash a little bit. It's a uh, it's a lot nicer. It's a little clearer, um, and I love the new steering wheel. I don't know if you can see that. You could do your Bluetooth. You could do all your entertainment functions are now, and of course your crew cruise. It's all right through the steering wheel. It's a small radius steering wheel. Feels great in your hands. I can kind of picture off-roading on the with the steering wheel a little bit better. It's so nice. Oh, and here's one thing that I always like to show people. Little details that make these Jeep Wranglers so special. Look at that. It's on all of them. The people that make these Jeeps, the Chrysler Corporation, and I know they make a lot of them, but whoever makes them, it's a labor of love. You can tell that they love these, and they don't mess with the tradition and the brand. And I really respect them for doing that. That's your upgraded sound system. You see the tweeters? Again, that's part of the, um, the Unlimited Sahara. See, that's the interior of the vehicle. I'll show you what the, it looks like with the exterior and interior. The white with the saddle. That looks just so nice together. And this was an option, obviously, too, the body colored hardtop. And this vehicle also does have the remote start system. And the, oh, and here's something that I'll show you as well. This was another important um, option from the factory. But you can see this right here. See that little tag? That is for the side airbags that come from the seat. That's very important. It was about a $500 option from the factory. Kind of neat. And I'll show you the tires. These are all uh, Bridgestone 18 inch tires all the way around. And they have tons of tread left on them. I'm sure you could see that. But they all measure 930 seconds. So you have lots and lots of life left on them. And I'm going to zoom into uh, the wheels as well. And if I notice any imperfections, I'll point them out. Again, the previous owner uh, looks like they filled up the tires with nitrogen. Whether you believe in that or not, it at least shows that they cared enough to do that, which is a good sign. It's a very good sign. The wheels look great. I don't see any, I really don't see any imperfections on them. Here's the spare. Spare looks like it's brand new. You can even see the, uh, you can even see the nubs on the tires. I think that measures 1330, 1330 seconds. So those are new. The rest of them are 930 seconds. Oh, I thought I saw a scuff, but it's not. It's just a rivet. Yeah, the wheels look great. I can't really point anything out. Well, that's our Jeep Wrangler. Again, I will be driving it. <laughs> I love it. Uh, we do have, uh, if you'd like to take a look at it, we have the Carfax and the Auto Check Report on our website. Uh, no issues or problems or accidents, none of that. Uh, but you can see that uh, at www.chicagocarsdirect.com. And if you have any questions that this video didn't answer, feel free to give us a call at 630-889-0911. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.